Alright, so. Um. Did the pro revolution here. Here to talk about. Bound for Glory 2010. And before I will get into this review, I want to say something. Um, to clarify my Monday Night Raw review, was that that why the camera was turned upside down as I showed the picture of John Cena and the Rio for Hell in a Cell. And then the camera moved like this, upside down. Oh. Here's the thing. I was so pissed off that I couldn't take it. I couldn't take it anymore. Because, here's, because, because you can bet your life that John Cena represents everything Everything that is wrong with for professional wrestling. The, so far, John. So far, John said, "Let's get through this, baby." Bound for Glory 2010. 10, 10, 10. Um, it wasn't a bad show. It, it really wasn't, but it wasn't a good show. It wasn't a good show. That is the thing about it. Um, it wasn't a good show. By comparison, it it wasn't. But I really um, and the ten 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 thing will be the main. So let's get. It. I want to say that the the state look awesome. The state look awesome. And the crowd was hot for everything. The crowd was hot for it. Except for Orlando Jordan. If it there was gonna but where you gonna you heard great great kiss. He heard great kiss. So let's get into this World Tag Team Championship Match Generation Me the Challenger Wrestle Money City Machine got the champion. This was a very good match. Kika. Um, I think it could be a little bit higher of the car. Well, maybe for fun revolution right there when they made it, but here is the thing. But, but that was at a fair pay per view. This is it could be a lot. But it's just me. But it's just me. Um, Mom Super. Oh yeah, fail for a Naka Championship match. Uh, you had injury a lot to defend the championship against Terra. Madison Rain and Belvis Guy. Um, it was okay. Probably better than Knockouts Fail Forward for 2011. Ooh, I, I will get into all the pro. But it was okay. Mad Terror wins. But he only dropped for Madison Rain for a week. I mean, what the fuck? It just me. It, you can call me a, you can call me a hater, but I don't care. The fact that Tampa won the championship, making JB a referee for the map, by the way, 
with Ted Williams as Sharon Fisher, only to drop it four days later. That's not Monsters Ball Mass. A best versus Rob Van Dam. Um, it was a very great match. There were some sick bombs. Like, rolling down the onto a bit, on um, base, into the, the ball wire. And then Janice. Uh, it, it was good. Why they didn't win? I think you could have this someone, but it just again. Uh, but nonetheless, still go man. Um, yes, man. Oh, every John and Randall Jordan was an ink ink. Very not like him, man. For I will say that yeah, every young man of under the look like a fish, which is really great, really great. The but first match, really nice fit. It world or air special time match, the J Lito defense against Dolph Runia. It was a very good match. J Lito retains. Ravi E for Jersey Shore comes out. At the time, I was like, okay, this could be a, a serious game, but time goes on. Very hard. Uh, 3 on 2 handicap match. Sting, the Pope, and Kevin Nash versus Samoa Joe and Jeff Jarrett. Oh my god. Very not like the match. Um, but as far as the heel winning, okay, okay. But do it have to be Kevin Nash get the pin? <sighs> Little Lord down. Very rare to have the match. Little Lord down. Wait. When lockdown is the picture, and yeah, you can. Yeah. So, but nonetheless, little lockdown, EV2 was the fortune. Um, EV2 windy, not agreeing with that because uh, I will say that, um, nearly every heel in that fashion who are in the match. I know that they get the upper hand in the last few weeks before the match, but here's the thing, it's powerful bro, it's official, and you have not have EV3 in the match, when all of the refresh team were the top heels in the very not like EV2. It was a very good rap for the ending. And many been time. Oh boy. This. This about that. It was. And I was a uh, very. May event. Triple Threat World Heavyweight Championship, man. Jeff Hardy versus Ken Anderson versus Kurt Angle. This was a what? Uh, my star weird bot. It was a very great match. Uh, but it will be a tier that figured out the school they finish. The school they fit. As real way enough for I have a few years I right know. Every bishop, Ho Ho, and Jeff here return here. As is already expected. And Jeff Hardy is the new TNA World Heavyweight Champion. Um as far as his heel as as the heel 
the, 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 uh, um, it was, it wasn't bad. For the time, it was really good. It was really good. But, as far as the audience here go, this is where I said before, but I forgot. I think it was kind of like three. As far as, as far as the heel turn for three, Bishop, Hogan, and Jeff Fury, this is what I had, what, what I say. The only way this will be satisfied is if the replication or Truly of that, but if it's going to be something inspired as Bishop Hogan and Jerry turn heel, telling what I wasted a numerous amount of time, or saying it's just something that is 90% of the fan already predicted when his angle first began. And that very felt predictable to me. Um, but. The Jeff I here to kind of say that? Kind of say. Kind of say. But as far as the immortal storyline, I will talk about more in my Bound for Glory 2011 review. But first, the paper will go. Very good shot. But congratulations and one show It was two thousand and one show you have easy to pull on your own fucking company is very weird. You have some much your gay pen pen by Karen and your world champion is the fun of drug trafficking. Sure, he had a high rate of time, but he was a trial door trafficking. That job. Shh. This fuck, this fuck company, swear to God.